In this video, let us solve problems based on internal bisector of an angle of a triangle. So here we've got the question which reads like this. In the figure given here, AD is the bisector of angle A. So angle A is bisected by the line AD. And if BD equals 4 centimeters and DC equals 3 centimeters and AB equals 6 centimeters, determine AC or find AC. It is pretty straightforward. The, the property or the concept that we have to use to find the side AC is nothing but we know that a line that bisects an angle divides the opposite side. In this case, it's BC. It divides in the ratio of the other two sides or the sides containing the angle. So, we have AB by AC equals BD by BC. Right? So, AB is given as 6 and we need to find AC. So, 6 by AC equals BD is 4 and BC is 3. Therefore, AC equals 6 times 3 over 4, which is nothing but 6 times 3 is 18, 18 over 4, which is nothing but 4.5 centimeters. So, the length of AC is 4.5 centimeters. The property used is, again, just for a quick recall, if, if a line bisects an angle, then it bisects the opposite side of the angle in the ratio of the other two sides containing the angle. Let's quickly solve another problem. So here we've got the question which reads like this in the figure AD is the bisector of angle BAC or simply angle A. If AB equals 10 centimeters, AC equals 14 centimeters and BC equals 6 centimeters, find BD by DC. So again, since AD is the bisector of angle A, it divides the opposite side that is BC in the ratio of the other two sides containing the angle. So very simple again, it is AB by AC equals BD by DC. So now we've got AB as 10 and we've got AC as 14 and we've got BD as X and we've got DC as 6 minus X. We just have to solve for X. The whole problem was about coming to this equation and that equation can be arrived at by knowing this concept. That is the line that bisects an angle in a triangle bisects the or cuts the or divides the opposite side of that angle in the ratio of the other two sides containing the angle. All you need to do is just solve this equation and find x, which is pretty simple. First, let's strike this out 2, 5 times, 2, 7 times. So, we've got 5 by 7 equals x by 6 minus x, which is nothing but 5 times into 6 minus x equals 7 times x. So, this is 5 times 6 is 30 minus 5x. 5 into minus x is 5x. This is minus 5x equals 7x. So, 30 equals 7x plus 5x, which is 30 equals 12x. So, we've got 12x equals 30, or x equals 30 by 12. 6, 5 times, 6, 2 times, and 5 by 2 is 2.5. So, x is nothing but 2.5, and therefore, it is going to be, the side DC is going to be 6 minus 2.5. And the side BD is going to be 2.5. So, X is going to be 2.5 centimeter. That is nothing but BD. And DC is going to be 6 minus X, which is 6 minus 2.5. So, this is going to be 3.5 centimeters. So, DC is 3.5 centimeters and BD is 2.5 centimeters. Another very easy and straightforward problem based on the concept that a line that bisects an angle in a triangle divides the opposite side in the ratio of the sides containing the angle that it just bisected. So I'll see you in the forthcoming videos with more concepts based on triangles.